And these types of photos in Fairmont were unheard of at the time because stars in Hollywood wanted to project this air of almost royalty and no one really wanted to acknowledge their real past. So the fact that Dean was willing to be vulnerable and to show his roots and where he came from and spend time with his family and get it captured and published in Life magazine was really a big deal. One day while walking around town, they passed Hunt's Furniture Store and Dean said, hey, let's go in here a minute. And they went into a windowless back room that was full of caskets. And Stock did not like this. He didn't get a good vibe. He didn't want to do it. But Dean talked him into it. And he did all these silly poses. And Stock recalled once he had kind of worn himself out with all these ridiculous actions, he let his guard down. And he got this really poignant portrait. After the story ran, East of Eden came out. Everybody wanted a piece of James Dean. Everybody loved the photos that Stock took.